I'm representing a client who I know is guilty of murder. The question is, do I do my best to get him off or do my worst so that he pays for what he's done? All right. So your question is, Will your natural competitiveness override your moral compass? Have you ever had sex with a patient? No. If I wasn't your patient, would you have sex with me? No. Why not? You mean apart from professional misconduct, the breach of ethics... Okay, so who are you sleeping with? A cute little brunette from the gym, perhaps? Don't worry. I'm not stalking you. I just saw you there together. A few times. You can't just cut me off like this. Emma, you have already transferred very inappropriate feelings onto me. Sexual attraction is inappropriate, is it? When it's used as means of power and control, yes. I'm sorry. It's just a defence mechanism. I still find it really difficult to talk about some things. When my mother died, I locked myself in a room and I wouldn't come out. My dad took the door off the hinges and said that if I wasn't strong enough, I'd end up like her. We never talked about her again. I'm sorry. That doesn't change anything. 